Fortnite Squad. Yo, what's up guys, it's your boy, I'm Nico Arc here, welcome back to the channel, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys all the map changes that came along with the V 8.40 update, so I hope you guys do enjoy this video, if you do, let me know by dropping a like on it, and do not forget to let me know down below in the comments if I miss any map changes, and also, what are your thoughts on this update? Personally, I think this update is pretty insane, the map changes are insane, and I'll be showing you guys them in this video, so without further ado, it's your boy Nico Arc, and let's get right into the video. Alrighty guys, so real quick, if you guys want to support me in any way possible further, make sure you go in your Fortnite item shop, type in Omnic Arg, no spaces, send me a video or picture over on Twitter, Instagram, or Discord, it'll all be linked down below in the description that you bought anything with my code or that I've seen your item shop in general. Very appreciated guys, you understand, I want to thank you guys in every way possible because I appreciate everything you guys do for me. Without further ado, it's your Omnic Arg, and let's get right into the video now. So guys, as I usually do this video, is I'm going to go from the ones that are most obvious to the ones that you probably don't know about. So the first one is the most obvious one, the bunker under the lake. But first off, I'm not going to explain to you guys going in depth, everything like that, because I'm going to make a separate video on the types of events that are coming very, very soon for that. But here's just a brief run through of speed up version of what this actually looks like and what's actually on the bunker. So I find this bunker pretty insane. Like I said, I'm not going to talk too much about it because I want to save it for a separate video. I'm going to make it in about two hours after this one goes live. But the next thing I'll be talking about is the bunkers that are found under the map there's three bunkers two at pleasant park and one at retail row so as you can see on screen right now, here's the first one over at Pleasant Park. I find these pretty insane. If I didn't see a video on these new bunkers on Twitter or something like that, I would never have known they were in the game. I find that pretty crazy how hidden they are. I doubt most of you guys knew there were bunkers, but and the funny thing is, over at Pleasant Park, if you guys mine under this tree, you guys just saw, you can actually go into the bunker through a separate way. So you don't have to go in the house, go everything like that. You can just go into the tree, mine under that tree, and bam, you're on the bunker. But the next thing I'll be showing you is the second bunker over at Pleasant Park. As you guys can see right now, I find this one pretty insane because you mine like a little furnace kitchen thing and you're in there. That's pretty insane. But the last one I'll be showing you guys is the one over at Retail Road. This one, I think, is the most hidden one out of all of them. You go under where the car is parked and it's right there. That's pretty crazy. So that has definitely something to do with the storyline in every way possible, but the next thing I'll be explaining to you guys is the house at Snobby Shores. You know how like the Vikings are taking over all them houses? Well, the last house at Snobby Shores is getting taken over, and they're putting up a fight. You can see everything's barricaded, everything like that, but as you can see, they're losing the fight because it's taken over by the Vikings. But that's basically a brief explanation of what's going on over there, but the next thing I'll be talking about is the Dur Burger has officially came over at Retail. Well, you can see on screen right now, there's a full Dur burger restaurant and a full tomato restaurant like they were usually in the game and now they're over at retail bro so i find that pretty insane how they're keeping this feud going a little bit i find that pretty funny so the last two changes I have for you guys in this video, this one is the rock statues have finally going to be together. So as you can see right now, the one rock statue is going down the mountain like shimmying down, and the other one is slowly on the lava island. So yes, they're going to meet with each other once again. I found this pretty funny how they did this throughout the whole entire season. They were far away towards the beginning of the season, and they're slowly coming together, fell into the lava, everything like that. I find that pretty funny. But the last map change I have for you guys, there are actually telephones around the whole entire map. If you guys see these in any way possible, possible it is just for a challenge that'll be coming very very soon in the near future only for a challenge nothing really like that but i think i have to visit the different telephones on the whole entire map but that's all i have for you guys in this video it was just letting you guys know all the map changes that came along with this update i'm sorry this video is all over the place first i'm trying to get a lot of videos out for you guys and a stream later so you guys can equally share the experience with me on this new update so without further ado it's your winner guard if you guys enjoyed this video in any way shape or form make sure you drop a like on it let me know down below in the comments if i missed any map change and also your thoughts on this update like i said i like this update a lot i hope you guys are liking it too make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel if you're new if you made this far into the video you made it to the end and you're not subscribed yet i don't know what you're doing make sure you hit that big red button there to subscribe without further ado it's your winner i've been talking for way too long and i'll talk to you guys in a couple hours with a brand new upload peace